welcome back to my channel this video is gonna be my lip service update um, let's get into it so I had five five products to start with and let's talk about the first one which is the buxom full-on lip polish in um, Dolly um, this is where I currently am I did mark it this time I didn't forget so maybe I'm a little less <laughs> Um, I am currently over here. This is where I am currently. Um, the mark line, it's not straight line. No, it's a little bit, I, I'm a little bit lower than the line, but that's okay. So I would say I'm about very close to being halfway done with this product, maybe not all the way, but um, yeah, I'm gonna keep using this thing and hopefully finish it in a couple of months. The next product that I did have is also by Buxom and this is the lip liner uh, in Dolly Danger. The writing starting to wear off on these. Um, let me pull out my paper so I can show you my progress, my overall progress. I really have not been using this product too much so my progress is still very slow. The line that I have over here is from um, 16th of January. Uh, yeah, this is lined up pretty well at the bottom. So, yeah, um, I still have quite a bit, quite a ways to go. It could probably need use some sharpening. It's kind of like, yeah, I could use some sharpening on this, but I don't know. I don't like to sharpen these products too often. I like to use get as much use out of them as possible. So. Um, so that's that. The third product is also by Buxom and this is the Begin Sexy Sultry Mauve Lipstick. Um, this I've made the most progress on. Um, let me show you so you can see like where the thing is actually in the packaging. Um, and this is it pulled like twisted all the way up. So I've definitely made the most, made the most progress on this product and um, oh. So, <laughs> come on lighting. Okay, so here's where I am. So I don't have a whole lot left. I think after I wear it all the way down, I might use something to scoop it out of the, out of the product, uh, out of the packaging. I know there usually is quite a bit left in there. So I may do that. Um, so yeah, I think I'll probably finish it in about two months, maybe a little less. We'll see, I'm gonna keep working on this. Um, once I finish this guy up, I am gonna replace it with something else. Okay, one product that I just give up on and I'm gonna take it out of this project and replace it with something else is the Lip Scrub by Sarah Happ and this is the brown sugar. This thing is just did not wanna go anywhere and I was using this as much as I can. Um, it got to the point where it wasn't really moisturizing my lips or anything like that. It was exfoliating them. But then it would leave them kind of dry, um, maybe because I was just using it too much, trying to use it up. Um, it smells really good. I'm not gonna declutter it or anything like that, but I am gonna take it out and I'm replacing it with a much smaller lip scrub. And this is the Hanalei Sugar Lip Scrub. This thing smells absolutely amazing. It has like kind of like a margarita smell, a lime lemon smell. Um, I have been using this product. I, I, repl I would say about two weeks ago, I made the decision that I'm just done with that. So I started working on this one instead. So you can see a little bit of use. And the one thing I notice about this product is it has some sort of moisturizing properties that that one did not have. Yes, it is a sugar scrub, but it also leaves my lips feeling like I just put a lip balm on too. So um, I think I can finish this pretty soon. And if I do, I will replace it with another lip scrub. Not going back to the Sarah, ha the Sarah Hap one for a long time. Um, that thing is a beast and I kind of just gave up on it. Um, I wasn't excited to use it. I didn't feel like it did what it should do. Yeah, exfoliated, but it left my lips feeling very dry and I did not like that. Um, the last item that I do have is the Laneige Lip, lip Sleeping Mask. This I have been using and I actually started using it not only at night because sometimes at night I was starting to forget to use it. Um, so what I've been doing with this product is I would apply it on my lips while I'm doing my makeup and then so my lips would be ready for a lipstick when I'm done with my whole face. 
I have made some progress on this. You can see like I've expanded um, that dip in there. I, I do have a lot of product left in here. Um, but I'm, I am working on it. I do really, really enjoy this product. So I'm not gonna give up on it anytime soon. I'm gonna continue to use it. Um, but yeah, I think this is gonna take the whole year. Probably even won't finish it this whole year. But I'm gonna keep using it. Uh, so that's it for my lip product for my lip service project pan. I will leave Fantastic Ladies link down below. This project is in collaboration with Fantastic Ladies, um, so you can go ahead and check the Facebook page for them. And if you're if you like it, you can sign up. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.